8 o'clock is the time, and right now we are going to get started with breaking news updates just into our newsroom. We are getting a better idea of the chaos and confusion that broke out minutes after Saturday's deadly shooting near Tennessee State University. Now, we want to warn you, some of the details that we're going to provide for you right now may be a little disturbing to some of the viewers. Fox 17 News just received some of the 911 calls made shortly after 5 p.m., during the school's homecoming celebrations there on Jefferson Street. Take a listen. Lady got shot. This lady got shot. Okay, where at on Jefferson are you? Where, 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 um, I, I, I'm, I, I'm not, uh, we're, we're on 2701 Jefferson Street. This lady got shot. Well, sadly, one person did die during Saturday's shooting. Nine others were hurt. Overnight, Metro Police announced that these two people right here, Marquez Davis and DeAnthony Brown, were arrested in connection with the shooting. They were picked up at a short-term rental over on 26th Avenue North. And both of these men right here on your screen are charged with criminal homicide. Metro Police also confirming that five people involved in that shooting were affiliated in some way with local gangs. The police also tell us that Davis is a suspect or he was one of the suspects picked up last night. He was already convicted on robbery as well as felony gun possession, felony drug possession. That happened in April of this year. He was sentenced to probation and was in a community uh, redevelopment program. 